given that the uh, league is about to start in just two days. In all, or really, on all fronts, are they ready now? I feel that uh, we are ready for this uh, first match. Uh, we'll see, but um, now they um, they give me the, the the confidence to to face the the, the first match. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Uh, we don't know the level of the teams in this moment, but um, I believe that um, we can uh, we can perform uh, well. So what might be the most difficult uncertainties you might face uh, that you can predict, if you will? I think the, the, the worst problem is the, um, we don't have the supporters with us. Uh, understand? Because uh, playing football without supporters is um, something without sense. Mm -hmm. understand? But, but we, understand. We, understand, we understand. We understand the situation. Uh, it's a long time, a long, long time without competition, right. and uh, this is another problem. But um, match after match, I believe that we can, uh, we can um, achieve our level. At least we have the games there. That's just very important. But are you impressed with the safety measures taken by the local authorities so far? We do. We have the training in our uh, training center where we have all the conditions, uh, different conditions. Mm -hmm. Uh, but um, but um, I believe that um, they try everything to 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 give us the con the, the the conditions to 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 have a good performance in the in the games. Mm -hmm. Now is is a bit weather is a bit uh, difficult, uh, but um, this is the the message that I that I pass to my team. Uh, we, we we didn't come here to to complain about nothing. You understand? Right. Mm -hmm. uh, we just come here to compete and uh, and to win, to try to win. So many are saying the title for this season is really up for grabs. What's your take on that? It's a, a bit unpredictable because you know, uh, for sure. Um, I ask my players to be ready to help the team because uh, we need to, to do rotation. We need to, to play with, uh, with everybody mm -hmm. because it's impossible to play a lot of match in a row uh, with the same players. Uh, for that reason, we, we need to, to be ready. We need to, we need to prepare everybody and uh, uh, was what uh, we, we try to do. In addition to SIPG, what might be other teams that could be title favorites. Name a few, if you will. Is uh, is a bit uh, unpredictable. I understand. I cannot. Uh, I cannot guess uh, the level of the teams. I don't know. After a few games, half of the <laughs> of the season. Uh, that's a fair statement. But your player, your midfielder, Oscar, mentioned that actually the target for SIPG doesn't change at all. Namely, CSL title and AFC title this season. And uh, it seems that he is very confident about it. Uh, we got the league two years ago. Uh, the last year, last season, we fight uh, until the end. And now is 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 normal that uh, our goal is uh, is the title. You understand? We cannot say that. Okay, if if um, uh, we get the the second position or the third position is uh, is good for us. I can't I can't say this. Uh, is we, we need to, to have to focus in our target and our target is to, to, to get to, to get the title. Victor, someone might say that uh, you have a, this kind of hot temper. Your hot temper can be motivation or drive to push the uh, players of your team uh, to the limit. On the other hand, they may say that you know this kind of a short temper could get yourself into trouble. And after being in China for two years and a half, what do you think you need to do more in order to really blend into the team and to give this team another facelift? It's the balance between, uh, between um, the, the, the way that you push them. This, this is very important in, and uh, the, the experience in China. I, I think I came here to, to be a little bit more patient, understand? To yeah. learn to be patient. Now I think I have the, the picture, uh, the, the good picture of the, of, of the league. And the way to, and I'm adapted to the to the culture. Understand, coach? What about your former player Wu Lei, uh, a Chinese uh, popular football?
player in Europe right now. And of course, unfortunately, his team, Espanyol, got relegated from uh, uh, Espanyol, I mean, from uh, La Liga, rather. But up to this point, is he going to stay or should he stay or should he uh, come back to your team? What do you make of it? And what do you think he really should do? If he wants to come, I can I can take a flight and I go for myself to 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 take him to to come back. <laughs> understand? Mm -hmm. Because he's a, he's a top top player and uh, it's not only uh, the quality as a player; is uh, the leadership. He's a leader. Understand? Uh, everybody respect him and uh, and was very very important for us. Mm -hmm. But uh, I know fully. I know is um, his ambition, you understand? And his ambition is to to have um, a career in Europe and to 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 be to have a success in Europe. Mm -hmm. I believe that uh, you will try maybe another 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 club or another league. I don't know. I don't know. But I believe that he uh, will stay there. Uh, he will stay in Europe. I believe. I don't know. Mm -hmm. If you if you want to come, I go there and I I buy my flight <laughs> to bring him. Thank you so much for your precious time with us, Rui. And again, much obliged for your input. Thank you. Wish you all the best, coach. Okay. It was my pleasure and thank you a lot.